friends why i am sharing this case there is a interesting aspect behind this this was my first cure first cure of my life and i still remember the patient there was a lady mrs desuza she was suffering from bronchial asthma for last 8 years she came to me for the treatment and she was referred by another patient she was not responding to any of the conventional treatment whatever she would take she had no relief she would be on bronchodilators she would be taking all kind of puffs and tablets and no relief i started taking the history in few seconds can we have the chat also seen please on my can i view the chat also so suddenly during the interview in few seconds she got up from the chair and she walked away she just walked away what will you do it's the beginning of your practice friends we face this problems every day and homeopaths have to be very sharp very intelligent very quick in taking certain decisions now it's the beginning of your practice and the patient walks away out of your consulting room what will you do now tell me yes richard what will you do is your beginning of the practice you have not settled down so richard says that you would convince and make us say jagrut it's her it's a lady yon go after her anna i would go after her she does not want to be seen friends say yeah, it's it's a beginning of your practice you don't have patience you have to survive what will you do see we have to be practical just within few seconds or few minutes rather she got up and ran away yes richard we have to ask why exactly ask her the reason bhuvna yes so what did you ask what did i do i ran after her i ran after her she was in the waiting area i inquired what happened mrs desuza <laughs> and she said you are asking too many personal question too many personal questions so you know i was i was just 22 when i saw her for the first time so i convinced her in homeopathy and i was very naughty so i convinced her i you know somehow made her understand that in homeopathy all this details are required and then only i'll be able to get the right medicine she said no you ask me only relevant question but when you are naughty you know rachel when you are young you are naughty so i was just 22 21 22 so again i asked some question and again she got this stuff she just got up from the chair 
So I said, what happened, Mrs. D'Souza? What is wrong? Tell me. We spent half an hour asking different ways, different points. But I, she was not very much open to it. It was very shocking. So I said, how do you feel better during asthma? There was a beautiful thing. You saw that picture. She said, I get up. I sit up and throw my head backward. This is the only thing gives me relief. I was sure of the medicine, the potency and the repetition. Friends, what is the medicine? What potency will you give? And how frequently would you repeat? Sarita says that from your wow. Please interact now. Dweep Narayan. What else? Anybody else? Chamomila. Spongia. Kalika. Beautiful. I love this. I love interaction. Please, friends, very troubled. Help ourselves. Apar, Glennie says Apar self, nitricum, nitricum acidum. Now, okay, Bryonia, beautiful. Now, can somebody tell me the correct medicine was Apar self? Correct medicine was Apar self. Why? Abhijit, I want to know the reason. A parcel. Why? Impulsive reaction. Beautiful. Hepa reacts impulsively. Beautiful. Sensitivity. Dr. Das says. Excellent. What else? Excellent. What else? You have a glen is beautiful. Chart of position plus sensitivity and anger. That is the correct answer. Glennis has a chart of position. I'll just show you what exactly happens. We just search in the repertory. Ask man head. And what does it give? A parcel attacks of suffocation, which force the patient to throw back the head. Shortness of breath. See how beautifully. There's nothing out of world. Everything is given in our books. And sorry, what potency and why? I want to know the reason. 30. Why? How frequently? 1M. Mary says 1M. Strong reaction. Beautiful. Repeated hourly. Richard says 1M. <laughs> See, understand, understand what is happening. The patient is suffering for eight years. Eight years, the sensitivity is high. Susceptibility, reactivity is very high. The bronchodilators are not helping. That means the disease is advanced. Disease is quite advanced. And how did she react? She reacted very violently. So, you know, you have to be very smart. So I told the compounder, I said, get Heparacel 201 dose. High sensitivity, high susceptibility. So we gave 200. I said, 
get the medicine here. So I got the medicine and put it in her mouth. Because I was not sure that this medicine, if I give her the two previous incidences, will allow me and she will take the medicine at home. So I gave her Heparsal 200, one dose right in front of me. And what happens? Just one dose dead. Okay. Result was this patient never reported in her life. I have seen her only once. And after that, she started sending patients one after another. In three weeks of time, she must have sent many, many patients. And in three months, I got 20 to 30 new cases. 20 to 30 new cases. See how one case you help, your practice is settled. Friends, focus on your practice. Focus on the patient in hand. We are always anxious of the next patient. Focus on the patients in the hand. In three months, she referred me 30 patients. My practice totally changed. Okay. And those 30 patients referred me many more patients. This is the shift. Now comes the next part of the story. Okay. Then comes a lady who referred. Her name was Tina De Silva. Tina, I explained the entire story. What happened, how Mrs. D'Souza got up. And today, she is sending me so many patients. What is the reason? And Tina told me that Dr. Shah, she has the whole floor. She has whole floor to her access. Husband is very rich. He makes a lot of money. And six months in a year, he is out of the country. And this lady didn't want to tell her secrets. And what happened? Lady didn't want to tell her secrets. So she has many, many boyfriends. Her house has got three doors. Three doors. It's a whole floor she has occupied. So a boyfriend enters from one door, another leaves from the other door. And that is how she has many, many friends and she has been having multiple relationship. But she didn't want to tell you all these things. And that is how she reacted. She reacted so badly. So it was a perfect simile, mum. It was a perfect simile, mum, with the correct potency, correct medicine, and correct repetition. This was the first cure I saw in my practice with one dose of medicine. The first cure of my life. Okay. She never got an attack after that. Not even one attack. This is homeopathy. The right medicine could produce miraculous results. Single remedy with cure.